San Rafael, California, you are beautiful. It is now time to call up the heavy hitters here at USA Crit San Rafael. It's Toyota San Rafael Sunset Criterium. San Rafael is another, it's obviously our backyard, but you get that environment and that excitement uh, at twilight or night racing that uh, is a component where you have a course going through a small downtown a city that has eateries and bars. There's all kinds of things for the spectators to do, including watch, watch the race. You know, we call it, uh, it's NASCAR on two wheels. So it's super exciting in a, in a, if you're a cyclist to understand how technical and how fast in the decision-making process that these riders have to do. Uh, it's extraordinary. And I mean, people get excited, it excites them, and it gets them motivated to ride their bike even more. It's a, it's a really interesting course. It's only just a rectangle, but coming into turn one, it's a pinch point. You go straight uphill and then turn four, it's the same thing. You're coming down out of a fast turn, but it's a false flat to the finish. So it's, it's rough, but you know, it's a really good course and it plays into our strategy, so I think we're going to have a good day here today. Cycling is really hard to follow if you're just jumping in and starting to watch the Tour de France. But if you, if you trim it down all the way to a Twilight Criterium in San Rafael or Athens or Boise or another, another hub of cycling across the, across the US, it takes it down to a point where it's super digestible. And it, it offers this, this spectating uh, arena that, that is short, fast, hard, all these things that we want to see in North American sport is right there in front of you. And, and you don't really have to fully understand bike racing quite yet if you just want to get that energy and that, you know, that emotion of, of, of the race, right? I always remember inviting friends and family to come watch bike races. And when, you came, and when they came to Criteriums, Seeing them before and then seeing them after was always such an amazing feeling because they would leave with this huge smile on their face as if they had no idea what they were getting themselves into and couldn't believe that we just hurled ourselves down these streets at, at ungodly speeds wearing absolutely nothing. And it was, this, it was always this beautiful feeling because you introduce somebody and one by one, Criteriums are doing that across the US. It's Cliff Bar against Mike's Bikes. Here they come down the stretch, ladies and gentlemen. Cliff! Far, Jack Allison, what a win! Jack Allison, your San Rafael Sunset Champion, the biggest win in Team Flip Bar's history. Colorado, Jack Allison. Like behind <laughs> Rocky, like holds it when he's 